Hi everyone, my name is Han Hui Hui and 3H means Housing, Healthcare, Human Rights, specifically Children Rights. So on 8 August 2024, I was summoned to Singapore Police Station and outside the police station, I filmed a live video saying that public resources should not be used on the 12 years of political persecution against me, but they should be used to protect our children and improve the lives of our future generation. But the AGC is still labeling me as the leader and demanding me to raise like $23,000 on behalf of Singaporeans and until today I still have a shortfall of about eight dollars to $9,000 which is why I'm making this video to raise awareness on political persecution and how bad the child abuse situation in Singapore is. So in the previous videos, people were saying like, oh, those are child abuse cases in preschool and by fathers. At least the mothers in Singapore are not abusing the children. Really? There are mothers who physically hit their 6 years old to the extent that the child is physically abused, like their bodies are covered with bruises. Just imagine yourself having a belt hit you more than a hundred times. Compared to the previous videos when the kids actually died, this 33-year-old woman beat up the child and the child did not die. But now this kid got to live with this kind of trauma for the rest of his life. Is he going to think that beating people up is going to be a normal thing? And will he grow up to become like one of those kids who go and coerce one guy, one boy, to go and do disgusting act against a girl and then start beating other people up because his parents did it to him? And why is it that like this mother is she stressed up over taking care of so many children? Is Singapore a very stressful society to live in? Which is why parents are beating their children up. Teachers are beating the students up. Teachers are supposed to care for the children. Why are teachers beating the children up? And if teachers do not want to take care of children, why are they working as teachers? Is it because they are in for the money? Because of the high cost of living, they have no choice or they so-called bobian. Go and take care of the kid or work as a teacher. But they actually do not want to take care of the kid. Therefore, they physically abuse children in Singapore. Leave your comments down below. Remember to follow me and I will see you in the next video.